Hello and welcome to the Math for Fun and let me show you how do you find the slope of a line from the graph. The most important thing here is to pick up two points that are lying on corners like the point minus 3, 5 and 3, minus 4. And then you can either go from the lower point to the upper point or from the upper point to the lower point but in this order. You have to go straight downward and then to the right or you have to go from the lower point to the upper point upward and then to the left and using the rule rise over run. So remember that if you go up count in positive, if you go down count in negative, if you go to the right count in positive, if you go left count in negative. Let me show you how. Now from the upper point to the lower point we are counting downward 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and then to the right 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So you count it down, count minus 9, and since to the right, count it plus 6, so you'll get minus 9 over 6. Now, if we want to go from the lower to the upper, then we count upward 9 units, which is positive 9, and to the left, 6 units, but it is negative 6, it will be plus 9 divided by minus 6, which is 9 over negative 6, which is minus 9 over 6, which is the same as the previous one. Let me show you the second case. Here we have the line increasing from left to right. So let's pick up two points. We have point on negative 3, negative 4, and we have another point on 0, 4. So if we want to find the slope, so make rise over run. So let's do rise over run, pick up one point and go to the other point. Let's pick up the lower point now. And from the lower point to the upper point, we say 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And to the right, we have 1, 2, 3. So we're moving up 8 units right 3 units which means that plus 8 over plus 3 which is 8 over 3. Let me show you the vertical and the horizontal lines. For the horizontal line you can pick also any two points. Any two points on the line but make sure that they belong to corners. Let's pick up two points on corners. Let's say we take the point minus 3 minus 1 and the other point which is at 1 minus 1. So we ask ourselves are we going up? No. Are we going down? No. So the rise is 0. And then we are moving to the right. So to move to the right, we count 1, 2, 3, 4, which is the run. So now we have 0 over 4, which means that it's equal to 0. So the slope is 0. Remember that the slope of any horizontal line is going to be 0. That would be a rule for you from now. Let's check the vertical line. Here we have a vertical line. Let's pick up two different points. We can take a point at minus 3, minus 2, and another one as minus 3, 2. Now, the slope is equal to rise over run. So let's check the rise. What is the rise now? It's 1, 2, 3, 4. And the run, we're not going left. We're not going right. So the run is going to be 0. So the answer is going to be 4 over 0, which is undefined. And also remember, this would be a rule for you from now. The slope of a vertical line is undefined. And these are all the cases for the slope of a straight line from graph. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you like the video, don't forget to like and share, and welcome to Math for Fun, and bye for now.